So, about six years ago, I started working at this food manufacturing company called Peach Foods. Hi, I'm Toma Momoshiro. I'm 27 and I hate my job. You wanted to see me, sir? Alright, how many clients do you have right now? Uh, four at the moment. Are they coming? Good, I think. I'll probably be able to close it by the end of the month. I see. In that case, I want all of it. I'll give you this in return. That's Mr. Kichisaru, the manager of the sales department. He was one of the reasons I hated my job. He always took credit for other people's work, and whenever things didn't go his way, he just dumped all the responsibility on someone else. He was a terrible person, but I was used to it by now. Well, if you're gonna pay me extra for the month, then I guess it's fine. Actually, I can't do that anymore. They're cutting our budget and... yeah. Sorry. You've gotta be kidding me! Whatever. There's nothing I can do about it anyways. It's better than losing my job. Thanks for your understanding. Here, you can have some of my accounts. <gasps> Wait, you want me to handle this account? They're a subsidiary of the Onigashima Group! Are you insane? They'll never do business with us! But I already talked to them once. They got a new CEO this year. She's pretty hot. What? But then, why are you giving it to me? Oh, uh, I tried hitting on her, but she said no. Then she told me to never come back, so... <laughs> You're joking me, right? <sighs> Whatever. Talking to him was a waste of time. I decided to give them a call. Let's just get this thing over with. Thank you for meeting me on such short notice. Sure. I had nothing else scheduled for today, so... I see. May I talk to the person in charge? I can handle it. Oh, okay. You sure? Of course. How can I help you? Excuse me, sir, but that's Miss Onishima, our CEO. I thought she was the receptionist. Damn it, I had no idea. Her name was Akine Onishima. She kind of looked like this girl I used to play with when I was a kid, but she had this cold look in her eyes. She seems upset. I wonder what Mr. Kichisaru did to her. So, you work under Mr. Kirazuru, huh? He's a disgusting person. Ugh, disgusting. Well said. I'm gonna start saying that. But I can tell you're a hard worker. You're not satisfied with your current conditions, but you still take work seriously. Sound about right? Yeah! How did you know? You're really good at reading people. Here, I brought you some pamphlets today. We sell this low-quality flour. It's not great, but you can't beat our prices. You don't try to hide anything. I like that. Thank you. I'll take a look later. Can you come back again tomorrow? Of course. Okay then. I have to go now. Thank you for your time. Oh, uh, what do I say? Is she testing me? I gotta think. Quick! Ma'am, your skirt is really short. <laughs> you noticed. I had it custom made. Could you turn around for me? What? Fine. Thank you! It worked. Sorry I'm late. Why is the door open? Excuse me. Oh, okay. What the? She was wearing short skirts again. I didn't mind it at all, but it was rolled up again. What's the deal with that? Yesterday you were wearing pink. Today you're wearing black. Huh? Uh, wow. What the? Did you see anything? Um, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> you used to do this to girls when you were a kid. You remember me now? Uh, I think so. You're Akine, right? You moved away when I was in fourth grade. I recognized you yesterday when we first met. What? Seriously? Yeah. You were my first crush. How can I forget? But after you left, I couldn't think about any other girls and... Now I'm a nerd. I only like girls from anime. I'm not interested in girls from real life. Ugh. I was trying to seduce you, but that didn't work. You haven't changed a bit, you pervert. Look, uh... Madam President, you said I rolled up your skirt when I was a kid, but... I never did that. I actually rolled it back down for you. What? Really? Yeah. Ah! There's that look. You haven't changed a bit either. Shut up. It's almost 6 p.m. You're not going back to the office, are you? Hello, Mr. Kijisaru. I just got hit by a meteor. I gotta go to the hospital. I'm serious. Okay, bye. Okay, I'm free. What did you have in mind? You just don't care, do you? Wow, look at this meat! Thank you! Of course. Eat up. It's on me. Ugh, you haven't changed a bit. You neither, Akine. The way you're always trying to act cool and stuff, and the thing you did with your skirt, too. 
I did that on purpose to get your attention. My childhood crush is now trying to seduce me? It's not like that, okay? I didn't mean to roll it up that high. I'm not used to wearing short skirts, that's all. I don't have eyes on the back of my head, you know. So Akine didn't have a dad. Her mother raised her single-handedly. Then when she was in middle school, her mom got remarried and... Turns out, he was the founder of the Onigashima Group. Up until last year, she worked at a different company. Her dad appointed her as the new CEO of his group company at the beginning of this year. Your boss is a disgusting person. Yeah, tell me about it. I hate him too. Yeah, I bet. Anyways, when I saw your name, I couldn't believe it. I think this was meant to be, you know? Oh yeah? Yeah, hold on. Let me go get him. Get who? The waiter? I want more meat! Daddy! Sir, I think you got the wrong seat. You've got some balls. I'll give you that. This is my dad. When I told him about you, he said he wanted to meet you. I'm Jockey Onishima. I'm the leader of the Onigashima Group. I see. I should go. The Onigashima Group was one of the biggest companies in the country, and this scary-looking guy was at the top. What's he gonna do to me? Is he here to kill me? So, Momotaro, right? Actually, it's Momoshiro. Right, thanks for coming. Uh, right. So, Momotaro. Whatever. Just kidding, Momoshiro. Tell me, you have a friend named Echizen, right? He's really good at tennis? What? No, that's a different Momoshiro. I see. What about Tao Pai Pai? No, it's Momoshiro. You added an extra kanji at the end. Ah, you're good. You win. What did I win? My dad, he's a nerd. He loves anime and stuff. So when I told him about you, he canceled all his appointments to come and see you. From now on, call me daddy. Or daddy cool. Whichever you like. Wow, I can tell that he's the real deal. So wait, you're gonna be my father-in-law? Uh, daddy? You're a sharp one. Look, Toma, I like you. I've always liked you. Ah, right. Thanks. Me too. That's it? I thought you'd be more excited about this. Well, I mean, I am, but your father's right here. Oh, don't mind me. I know I look scary, but I'm a really nice guy, you know. Toma, starting tomorrow, you're going to be the leader of the Onigashima group. Take good care of my daughter. The leader? You're joking, right? No way. I'd love to come work for you, though. Yeah, Dad. Stop rushing things. Right, right. All right. For now, you'll be Akine's assistant, then. I'll let your boss know that you quit. Toma, we got so much catching up to do. Hey, when you guys have kids, why don't you name him Ramu? Sounds good, Daddy. I've been thinking about getting a new job for a while now, so this was a really nice surprise. A week later, I started working at Onigashima Foods. Say hello to Toma Momoshiru, the next leader of the Onigashima group. He's gonna be Toma Onishima soon. Don't say it like that. Hello, everyone. I look forward to working with all of you. Hello, noble sir. Stop calling me that! Akine, tell everyone to stop giving me special treatment. If not, I'm gonna quit. Then I'll quit with you. Please don't. Okay here, Mr. Momoshiro. I'm putting you in charge of this project. Take a look. What is this? The ultimate Kibidongo? Are you serious? Yes, very serious. Work conditions at Onigashima Foods was great. Everyone was really nice and eventually, people started giving me special treatment. I loved working here. Oh, and the project they put me in charge of, it was a big success. Hey, I'm here. Come on in, dinner's almost ready. Thank you, I really appreciate it. Of course, it's my job to take care of you. <laughs> when we were kids, you always baked cookies for me, remember? She did? I didn't know that. Tell me more. Oh, he's here too, huh? Sorry, not sure how he got in here. Get out! Hey, the thing with your skirt, you should stop doing that. What? Oh, damn it. I wasn't doing it on purpose. You sure? That's like the third time that's happened today. Hey, uh, can I move in with you? What? Wait, so my plan to seduce you work? Not that. I'm just worried about you, that's all. I need to keep an eye on you. <laughs> this is great! <laughs> Akine, are you okay? You've been acting really weird lately. I mean, rolling up your skirt on purpose to get my attention? <laughs> I'm fine. Okay, let's ask her dad if this is okay. This is what she wants, right? Then I've got no reason to say no! 
Thanks, Dad. Bye. <laughs> hey, um, I've been wondering, how did you find out about me? Like, where I worked and stuff? Huh? Oh, I made my employees follow you and stuff. Ah, I see. That's not creepy at all. Huh? About six months later, it looked like everything was going my way. But then... Miss Onoshima! Mr. Onoshima! Huh? What happened? Everything okay? I found these around the building. Let me see. What the? Oh, this is my old boss for sure. I recognize his handwriting. He's such an idiot. The guy named Momoshiro, he slept with the CEO of this company. The note was all over the front door. Ugh, but we haven't even. Let's call the cops. Hold on. Huh? What now? What's that? Look at this, right here. It says if you go to the cops, I'll make a social media account under your name and say all kinds of horrible things. Haha. Ha. Ah, is he for real? What do we do? I don't know. Let's just ignore it for now. Let him come to us. Ten days later, he showed up at our office. Just as I thought, he had this huge tablet with him. <laughs> Momoshiro, once I click this button, you're done for. You hear me? What are you doing? Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I'm gonna tell the CEO that you're spreading false rumors about us! I see. So he's gonna spread rumors and tell people that it was you. That's pretty smart. Stop complimenting him, please. Right. Sorry. Hey, you! Get the hell out of here, now! You better leave while you can. Ugh. Screw you, bitch! That's it! I'm pressing the button! Ah! My fingers! Stop! Ouch! Who the hell are you? That's Daddy. I'm Jockey, the leader of the Onigashima Group. Your company is gone. What? I bought your company an hour ago. You all work for me now. And so, you're fired. Mr. Kichisaru, I really don't want to do this, but I got no choice. I got people to protect now. So you understand, right? Okay, okay. I'll do whatever it takes to protect Akine. So don't ever mess with me again. You hear me? Well said, son. Don't ever come near my family again, you sack of shit. Now get the hell out of here before I chop you up into little pieces. Go! <laughs> Sorry. So just like that, he lost his job. He went back to his hometown and started working at a pet store. When I got home that night, there was a disco ball in my room and the lights were all pink. Did your father do this? Hold on. Give me a second. Whoa, hold on! Let me propose to you first! Toma, I love you. You love me too, right? 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 What? Yeah, of course. Ah! Okay, now that we got that out of the way. What? Wait, hold up! I wanted to propose to you too! Too late, Toma. Stop trying to fight this. Ah, uh, I guess you're right. All right then, let's get started, shall we? Uh, yeah. Sounds like a plan. Come here, babe. I can't wait to have your kids. <laughs> and so, we made sweet love down by the fire. A few days later, my last name changed. I was now Toma Onishima.